All right, another day, another 20 posts on Reddit that Decky Loader is broken. Decky Loader won't load. Decky Loader can't install. I've got problems with Decky Loader. Well, it's time for me to show you how to take care of that. So you know the situation, you open up your side menu and this little plugin is gone. Or all of your plugins are gone, or you go into a plugin and it's broken. There's a whole bunch of different reasons why you might be watching this video. For the most part though, it's because this Decky Loader has completely disappeared, you have no idea why, and trying to reinstall it doesn't help at all. Go over to your desktop, Okay, once you're on your desktop, open up your Dolphin file browser, navigate to the home folder, and find a folder called Homebrew. This is where Decky Loader lives. If what you came here for is the promised 60 second solution, rename this to anything you want, rename it to Homebrew underscore, now go back and reinstall Decky Loader. That's it. You're done. You'll have to go back and reinstall your plugins and all that other good stuff, but that's the 60 second version. Rename homebrew to homebrew underscore, reinstall Decky Loader, put your plugins back in and you're good to go. Once you're done, you can right click and delete this homebrew uh, underscore because it's no longer being used. All right, the slightly longer version is there's a couple of different reasons why Decky Loader stops working. First of all, listen, Decky Loader's a hack. We all know this. Hacks don't work forever. Every time there's a system update, every time there's an update with Decky, every time one of the plugins updates, a million and one things could go wrong to cause Decky Loader to stop working, right? Typically speaking, it's a broken plugin that's not kept up to date, but sometimes it's a system level problem. The idea is you're probably never gonna figure out why. Now that you know how to actually get it back in short order, life is probably better. You can't, probably can't live without Vibrant Deck anymore. Maybe you can't live without Steam Grid DB. Um, there's a whole bunch of different reasons why. Now you know how to get it back. The other thing you can do is delete these plugins one at a time and reboot the Steam Deck and see if Decky Loader comes back. Uh, my recommendation, of course, is the quick and dirty version, which is rename the homebrew folder, reinstall Decky Loader, reinstall your plugins, bing, bang, boom, you're back at the mall. But if you wanna go through advanced troubleshooting, go into plugins, remove them one at a time, actually delete them or move them out of the folder, you can't just underscore them, um, actually get them out of this folder, restart your deck one at a time until you figure out which one's breaking your stuff. That's it, thanks so much for watching, like, subscribe, hit the bell, leave a comment, you guys know what to do. I appreciate each and every one of you I hope this worked for you. Leave a comment. Did it work? Did it not work? I try to read and respond to every single comment on every single video. Sometimes it doesn't work out, but I do my best. I'm Shane Armonroe. Thanks always so much for watching and take care.